And the foundation, with help from Nebraska Medicine and Children's Hospital, aims to help families with some of the costs that burden them when their children undergo organ transplants. A lasting legacy for two-year-old Lane Graves, who lit up so many lives. When we selected pediatric transplant, that the need was so big. Most of these families are not receiving help and have significant financial pressures that Lane's foundation has been able to ease. Through the Lane Thomas Foundation, Lane is helping children who need it most. Those who've undergone life-saving organ transplants. Children like 11-year-old Kylie Bush. She's a multi-organ transplant recipient and is now fighting cancer. It takes everything that you have when your child is on a vent and you have to leave to go, to go, um, excuse me, to go back to work just to make sure that they're going to get what they need. The foundation will provide financial support beyond medical costs that are covered by insurance. To navigate how you're going to pay your electric bill, how you can make a house payment. Allowing parents to be parents and to focus on the health of their child. My mom and my family could come visit more often. She could be her first uh, board of my surgeries now. Through education and outreach, Matt and Melissa Graves say they're working to prevent other parents from experiencing the pain of losing a child. We want parents to know without judgment that if they decide to make the ultimate decision to donate their child's organs, they will prevent other families from knowing their pain. And we believe there isn't a better way to honor a child than saving others. Without transplant, my heart kids don't have any other options. And I am so appreciative for the foundation, as are my families. The charity is called the Lane Thomas Foundation because Lane would always reply when asked his name, I'm Lane Thomas, I'm too. The foundation launched its website in September, the same month as Lane's birthday. Reporting in studio, I'm Megan Hahn, 3 News Now.